Hello electric car lovers! In this channel I cover all the latest tech news surrounding electric cars. I cover the background, feel and drive, the current select price and the specs and engineering that go into making each car. If you have an electric car that you'd like me to cover, let me know in the comments below. In today's video, I am reviewing the new Chevrolet Bolt EV. I'll be covering the most important features to see whether it crushes the competition or not with its significantly low price tag. Let's see whether it'll crush the competition or not. Oh, and one more thing before I start, a battery and a firework were arrested. One was charged, the other was let off. Okay, now back to the video. Did you know the fine new roads wasn't always Chevrolet's slogan? It was adopted in 2013. The previous slogan was Chevy runs deep. According to Mary Barra, Senior Vice President of Global Production and Development, Find New Roads is Chevrolet's new motto, which embraces the spirit of inventiveness that has been in our DNA since the beginning and will continue to govern every part of our company moving ahead. Background Chevrolet Bolt, also known as the Chevrolet Bolt EV, is a five-door all-electric subcompact hatchback with a front-mounted powertrain. LG Corporation collaborated in its development and production. In mainland Europe, a rebadged European variation was available as the Opel Ampera E. However, it was withdrawn after 2018. The 2017 Bolt went on sale in California in December 2016 with the rest of the US and other markets following in 2017. In 2017, the Bolt was the second best-selling plug-in automobile in the United States. By the end of 2020, the Bolt Ampera E family has sold 112,000 units worldwide. The Bolt was selected Motor Trend Car of the Year in 2017, North American Car of the Year, and Automobile Magazine 2017 All-Star and one of Time Magazine's Best 25 Inventions of 2016. The Chevrolet Bolt represents a new generation of affordable, long-range electric cars. The new Chevy Bolt EV for 2022 not only looks more exciting inside and out, but it also comes with additional amenities and a lower starting price. Design and Engineering the Chevy Bolt's front and tail, as well as several features of its interior, were completely redesigned for the 2022 model. New headlights, as well as fox grille and trim, have been added to the front. The tail lights and tailgate hatch are also marginally different from last year. The Bolt's size hasn't altered much. It has the same 69.5 inch width as the previous model, but is a half inch higher at 63.4 inches and around 0.8 inch shorter in length at 163.2 inches. The Bolt EV is clearly the same size as the 2021 Kona Electric, which is currently more expensive. The Chevy comes standard with self-sealing tires, which include a sticky material on the inside that seals minor leaks and punctures in the tread area. This is no spare tire, and there's no place to keep one officially. The automobile comes with a computerized tire pressure monitoring system that alerts the driver if a tire is leaking, as well as a portable air compressor kit as an alternative. There is a place under the rear hatchback luggage deck that may be utilized to store an undersized spare tire, and some owners keep a suitable Chevy Cruze spare tire there. Interior Chevy upgrades the Bolt EVs inside with a more premium design that includes better materials and soft touch surfaces according to the firm. The steering wheel now has a flat bottom and a former electronic shifter has been replaced by a combination of pull toggles and push buttons. The new Bolt EV features the same amount of passenger capacity as the previous model, including a rear seat that can accommodate two people. The hatchback's rear luggage capacity is still 17 cubic feet behind the back seats and 57 cubic feet when the rear seat backs are folded flat. However, according to GM, the 2022 Bolt has been updated based on user input, with more comfy seats and a more modern interior. In reality, the dash and interior appear more like a typical Chevy than a futuristic electric car, rather than the 8.0-inch digital arrangement of the dash cluster that carries over from the existing Bolt. GM's newest infotainment system is housed in a 10.2-inch touchscreen that allows wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto connections. A wireless charger is available as an option and the shifter has been replaced with a push-button mechanism in the center console. Physical volume and tuning knobs, as well as a shortcut button for the home screen, complement the touch controls. The Chevy's infotainment system also supports over-the-air upgrades and has built-in applications for Amazon, Alexa, and Spotify music streaming services. Performance 
The motor and chassis of the 2022 Bolt EV are identical to previous generations. Its electrical motor still only drives the front wheels, producing 149 kW and 266 pound-feet of torque. It also has an interior permanent magnet electric engine that accelerates from 0 to 30 miles per hour in 2.9 seconds and from 0 to 60 miles per hour in less than 7 seconds, with a peak speed of 91 miles per hour at a time. To build a single modular drive unit that links directly to the front axles, the electric motor is combined with a single-speed gearbox and differential. The ultimate driving ratio of the single-speed gearbox is 7.05 is to 1. This means that when a light turns green, the configuration gives immediate reaction to accelerator inputs and enough of low-end torque, allowing you to rocket off the line. At highway speeds, responses are slower, but the new electric Chevy should still make passing and merging on the highway a breeze. It's expected to give a smooth ride and lots of power, as well as a nice enough driving personality to dispel whatever unfavorable perceptions you might have about electric automobiles. A one-pedal driving mode enabled by a button on the center console boosts regenerative braking to the point where you seldom need to engage the brakes to slow down. Because the Bolt is still built on the BEV2 electric vehicle platform, Rather than GM's new Altium platform, the underlying technology remains the same. There are no plans to include the Altium technology into the Bolt EV or Bolt EUV. Jesse Ortega, GM's executive chief engineer for the Bolt and Bolt EUV stated during the teleconference. While the 2022 Bolt EV does not have GM's Super Cruise technology like its new brother, the Bolt EUV, it does get the Chevy Safety Aid package which includes lane keeping assist and safety features like automatic emergency braking and forward collision detection. Optional features include adaptive cruise control and rear cross traffic warning. Battery life. The 2022 model is expected to have a driving range of 259 miles on a full charge. According to Chevy, that's the same as the previous model year's EPA rating and it's on par with other similar priced EVs like the Hyundai Kona Electric. While the Tesla Model 3 long range can drive 353 miles on a single charge, it is significantly more expensive. For 2022, the Bolt EV will be available with a dual level charging line that fits into both 120 volt level 1 and 240 volt level 2 outlets, obviating the need for many owners to purchase a second home charger, according to Chevy. The Bolt's maximum level 2 charging speed has now been boosted to 11 kW, allowing it to fully charge the battery in 7 hours. With the level 3 connection, the electric hatchback can still add around 100 miles of range every 30 minutes. Automotive reporters driving a pre-production Bolt with a 60 kWh battery validated the EPA rated range of 238 miles. The trip between Monterey and Santa Barbara was completed with an energy usage of 50.1 kWh, reflecting an average efficiency of 4.8 miles per kWh. 12.9 kWh per 100 km, while driven in various driving modes with the air conditioning on. The Bolt has driven a total of 237.8 miles with 34 miles of range remaining on the display. Several other journalists drove a pre-production Bolt on the same route and reported identical results in terms of the EPA estimated range of the Bolt. Opel claimed to be driving an Ampera E without recharging from Piccadilly Circus in London to the Port de Versailles in Paris, the exhibition's destination, as part of its premiere at the 2016 Paris Motor Show. With 50 miles of range remaining, the rebadged Bolt traveled 259 miles, price and model range. Chevy is having some issues. GM and Tesla have sold enough electric vehicles that their vehicles no longer qualify for the federal tax credit that reduces the cost of an EV from Hyundai. Volkswagen, Ford, and other automakers so what do you do if the government refuses to assist you in lowering the price? It's something you do on your own. The 2022 Chevy Bolt begins at $31,995, which is $5,500 less than the 2021 Bolt currently on the market. It's also $2,000 lesser than the brand new 2022 Bolt EUV crossover, which was just released. So the 1LT version could cost you $31,995. As for the 2LT, it would start from $35,195. This wraps up my review of the Chevrolet Bolt EV. Let me know what you think of it. Thank you for sticking it out through the very end of this video. Nothing helps out my channel more than y'all watching the entire video. These videos take a long time to make and are a labor of love. If you'd like to see my channel grow, please help spread the word. And until next time, remember, the best experiences aren't about where you end up, but who you're lucky enough to be on the journey with.